So let's suppose you're a church uh, that wants to do training. You want to train people for, for ministry service, that is for pastoral ministry or for missions. Uh, what, what would be required of you? Do you need training for that? Well, let me say that if you're going to provide the Excel Ministries internship, we will provide some guidance and training for you. It's not complicated. We obviously already have the structure of the internship and the evaluations. Um, we want to make sure you understand your role in mentoring a person. You know, discipleship is a life-on-life -life ministry, right? So if you're a pastor and you want to mentor somebody, we, we want you to spend time with them. You need to meet with them, review their assignments, make sure they're understanding their theology, practice their Bible knowledge, those things that are going to be important for them. If you're going on a crisis call, we'd like you to invite the intern to go along so that he can learn and, and begin to comprehend the significance of the role that, that he's pursuing. Uh, you know, there's some basic things that are going to be important for us. We use a database that you'd need to learn how to use so you can upload uh, lessons and, and uh, evaluations uh, so that we have those in our record keeping. But as far as uh, overall training, I, I mean, I, let me say this. If you're going to mentor somebody, one of the things it does require is for you to be theologically astute. And so it may mean that you're going to have to do some studying. Uh, just to kind of catch up and keep your mind sharp. In fact, I would say that that's one of the benefits of mentoring, right? It keeps the leaders, the mentors sharp as well as the interns. And so that's going to be helpful. I will say also that for the systematic theology questions, we do provide an answer guide just to help the pastor and lighten his load a bit as, as he provides the oversight for the, the internship.